You know, I gotta say, this game is absolutely fantastic. I'm having so much fun with this right now. This is very, like, this is giving me the Subnautica vibes that I haven't had in, you know, quite some time. Oh, what's going on, everybody here? And welcome back to some more Forever Skies. Oh, it feels good to be back. So today we're gonna continue where we left off. We're gonna continue the exploration, the building of our massive, well, it's not massive yet. It's going to become a massive airship. Um, it's not there yet, but it will be. And uh, yeah, pretty exciting stuff. So hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do like, subscribe, all the fun things. If you missed the first episode, I highly recommend going and checking it out. But without further ado, let's get on into it. So we've got our fancy new build tool. I'd like to go ahead and get a ladder room, an additional floor of the airship with a ladder leading to a different level. Oh my goodness. That is actually fantastic. So we need some synthetics. We need some metals. We need some things like that. And we also need actually hold on. Do we have a new machine piece, if I'm not mistaken, right? We have a basic turbine. So I need some metals and then that would allow us to go up higher. OK, so let's do this. Um, let's actually actually, you know what? Let's go in here. Simple. Oh, wow. We're out of. OK, so we need synthetics. We need we need a whole bunch of stuff. Let's see if we can go ahead and grab some goodies while we're waiting here. Oh, they're right out of range. OK, you know what? We're going to have to move a little bit here. Did we already explore this one? Yes, we did. OK, so I moved a little bit. Let's go ahead and can we can we farm these things up now? Oh, wonderful. All right. OK, I farmed up a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, this is I you know, I love this because you can just take your airship. You can move it. It doesn't take any fuel. You can just sit there and grab all the goodies. Oh, it's so nice. OK. Um, hold on, we need to get, add that, um, bottle the water and we need to go ahead and requires bottle. Okay, so I need to get more bottles in here. Let's go ahead and let's do that. Empty bottle. We'll get one of those made. Is that making one or is that making five? Uh, bottle clean water, add dirty water. Okay. And let's see, where's our clean water? All right, so let's go ahead and use this. And then we need to go ahead and probably get, we need to get our basic turbine main. That will give us higher altitude. It should. <laughs> I really want to expand our airship too. Like I want to make like a massive airship. It's going to be amazing. You know what I'll do is while we wait for that, we will grab stuff because we need more stuff. Oh, we need to get over there. So do we have a bed? I actually, I, I didn't even think about that. Um, we, we kind of need a bed, I think. Um, okay, can we get this? So it's going to look kind of ridiculous for now, but it is what it is. <laughs> because I'm not on the ground and I don't want to land and uh, I want to continue building the airship anyways. But was there was there some kind of like a bed or anything? Which occur oh, we need to get an insect lure for sure because we gotta, we're going to have to make sure that we keep our food up. Um, but my energy, my energy is super low. Oh, there is a bed. Okay, let's get a bed made as well. All right, um, so now that we have that, let's see if we can go over to this uh, wind turbine place over here. Okay, we definitely, oh, look at that. Like, this is the clearest view I've ever seen in this place so far. Oh my gosh, this is super cool. <gasps> we can see for like ages. This is magnificent. Okay, we're gonna go over here, land on this place. Uh, it's it's a wind turbine place and it's got some white lights on it. It's gotta be good, right? <laughs> oh, there's like an airship frame. There's like airship pieces right over here. Increase altitude and land on location with a double flashing light. That's what we're doing right now. Oh, that's what we're doing because there's two flashing lights there. Yeah, see, there's like airship pieces right there. <gasps> oh my God, what are we gonna find here? This is a great place to build an airship, I think. Oh, there's like a whole bunch. Mm -hmm. There's like a huge, those look like bigger pieces. Maybe not. We've got, we got something over there. We got stuff in there. Okay, let's turn so we can maybe harvest some of this stuff right here real quick. Now let's go ahead and land nicely. It's all about the nice landing. What did we land? Oh, we landed on that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no. I can't get up there. Oh, I've made it. Wait, hold on. Ha ha ha. Okay. All right, we're fine. Nate can stay here. All right, let's see what we've got over here. Oh, you know what? Actually, let's go ahead and shoot some of these things out of here. Okay, we got those. All right, and then we've got a bed in here. Okay, so let's get let's get this guy. Let's just set it down right there, and then let's sleep. Okay, so that's gonna give us energy. It's gonna take food and water. That's fine. All right, we're good. Ha <laughs> ha! Yes. Take that. Let's go ahead and use use. That looks good. We got dirty water in here, maybe. Uh, add the dirty water. Okay, looking good. Food's good. Okay, let's go. All right, there's look. It looks like there's a whole bunch of goodies over here for us. Uh, scanner. Let's not. Oh, oh. <laughs> I was looking at it from the wrong side. Data card railing. OK, so we got railing that requires an airship builder, which guess what? We have an airship builder now. Requires deck extractor, more mechanical pieces. Wait, take fuel, mechanical parts. OK, so let's see. Ooh, a lantern, a circuit board. That is a GPU, my friends. <laughs> These guys were out here gaming during the 
during the virus. Well, you know what? <laughs> I think a lot of us were. <laughs> uh, let's see. Okay, let's take that. Let's see, let's get in here. We got you. Okay, so there's one. What else do we have in here? Uh, helium. Okay, so that's something new. Let's go ahead and take our... Uh, ooh, you know what? We need to make a storage box. We'll have to make a storage box and uh, grab the helium. I don't know what helium's for. But I guess we're going to find out. All right. Uh, do we have a storage container yet or no? Oh, you know what? That was a research thing, wasn't it? Okay, so here's the small... Okay, so research station, small storage box. Wait, basic fabricate. Wait, oh, it's right here. Oh my gosh. I'm a, I was like, wait, where do I research stuff? It's in here. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm a dummy. All right, so we'll start that. That'll get our, uh, that'll get that going. And I need to get a storage box. That way we can throw some stuff into storage. And then we can go back and grab the helium because the helium is something very special, apparently. Okay, so let's grab ourselves a storage box. Small storage box. Let's go make one of those. Oh, it's raining now. All right, so small storage container. Uh, maybe right here for now. How many things? Can <laughs> not very many. Um, oh, I can put that in my inventory. We're probably going to use that. Let's see. What are things that we're not going to use? Oh, I can probably get rid of those. So the repair patch tape in there. Copper. I haven't needed that yet for anything. Old canned water, maybe. And let's go ahead and drop these things. Okay. Let's go see if we can grab the helium now. Uh-oh, a storm is coming. That's not good. All right, so we got helium. Hold on. How bad is the storm? Like on a scale of one to two, one being nothing at all and two being the worst storm I've ever gonna face in my entire life. How bad is the storm? Oh, it doesn't seem very great. Okay, that's fine. Maybe we'll just stand inside. Uh, we got helium. So actually, I think we can research that. Oh, geez. Airship damage. Lightning strikes are a threat or higher altitudes. Lower the altitude or take cover to avoid damage. Uh, okay. I don't know where exactly to take cover. Maybe. Oh, geez. No fuel. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Uh, I need some synthetics and I don't see any. How is there nothing? There's nothing coming past us. Can I just go down then? Okay, we're just gonna, I guess we're just gonna chill here for a little bit. Um, I don't, I don't really know what else to do. Oh my God. Is there like, is there like a, is there like damage on here? I have no idea. This is terrible. Okay, um, I, I need synthetics. I have no synthetics whatsoever. I don't know where all the magic balls of resources are. They're like gone. Okay, it looks like the storm is passing. Oh yeah, look at the clouds breaking up. That's super cool. Okay, these all require my laser machine. All this requires laser machine. Okay. See, can I make it across here? Okay, that was a little terrifying. All right, so what do we have here? This is like a whole abandoned, broken thing. Uh, metal thing. I don't know what this is. Some kind of screen. Wrecked location radar. Displays locations and navigation stuff. Take some helium. Can't pick that up. Can't really do anything here. Okay, so it looks like basically the only thing I have here to do is to flip around and maybe harvest some of these resources. Uh, we need to get down in here, though, because it looks like I can go into that wind turbine. Oh, it looks like we can go across right here. Oh my God, this is terrifying. Oh wait, this is the same place. Oh, we could have walked right here and went out here. Okay, good to know. What do we got in here? Is there any super secret secrets? Oh, there kind of is some super secret secrets. Should we scan this? What are these? Oh, this is all copper. Oh, I bet we're going to need that. Bet you we're going to need that for something like super advanced. Um, Let's go ahead. We got to make more fuel. Oh, <gasps> wait, hold on. There's more helium down there. I didn't even notice that. There's a ladder right here. I'll take that helium. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. I think that's everything here. So we got some kind of radar thing and we've got um, some, some more copper and stuff like that that we need to research. So we might be unlocking some new items here. I'm not sure, but either way, I need to get on here and we got to get some, uh, we got to get some goodies. Okay. Synthetic fuels at the go. Hold on, let's get some water in here. Um, I probably need to go ahead and do some fishing as well. Let's see. What else do we have in here? Was there anything else? I need to kind of flip around. That was what I need to do. Okay. Let's do that real quick. Um, actually I can't do that because I need the fuel. <laughs> Uh, and then let's go ahead and throw the fuel in here. We'll flip around and we'll harvest some goodies. Actually, can I harvest? Nope, probably not. All right, Mr. Harvesting Gun, let's do this. Grab that. We're going to grab all this copper here. It's actually a great spot for these too, because it looks like they hover right behind us for a little bit. Oh, I missed a helium canister. Darn it. All right, we got to get over here. I got to do some fishing. Can't do any fishing if I'm just sitting here. Are we far enough out to fish? I think so. Um, let's see. Lower the lure. We'll get that going. Uh, let's see. How's this going? I need another membrane. Kind of wish the membranes would last a little bit longer. Like it seems like they're like a one-time use thing. Or maybe I need to just have more more refinery deals. Or maybe I should just make more membranes. Is there a way to like craft more? No, not really. <laughs> lower altitude to catch prey. Okay, so we need to lower our altitude. Hold on, let's get away from this place. I wonder what our altitude actually needs to be. There we go. Okay, good. Hey, look at We got a fat dust moth. Very nice. Let's go and cook that bad boy up. 
All right, boiling up one fat. <laughs> that sounds so <laughs> boiled dust moth. Ugh, that sounds so gross. Okay, so I need to get the. Uh, we need to get. Oh, extract a circuit board helium location radar. We'll go ahead and do that because we got some copper. Let's go ahead and raise this up. We got a dust moth. That not a fat dust moth, just a regular one. Hey, take boiled fat dust moth. Okay, I need this so bad. Use. Oh, look at that delicious foods. How's this looking? I'm waiting for you. I know you're gonna go any second now. Haha, <laughs> I told you. All right, lure module's gone. Let's go to craft another lure module real quick. Uh, we'll use a cooking station. Throw one of these in there. Take these out. Grab you. Throw you in there and boil. Fantastic. Uh, purification's in progress. Let's throw another condenser. I'm trying to get a little bit ahead on the full food and water. That way uh, we don't have to worry about it as much. Okay, and then we also got the scanner deal done. So that's good. Um, I want to increase the size of my airship like really bad. Let's go ahead and grab some stuff here. Oh, these are all out of range. All right, so that boiled dust moth is good. We'll take the lure, throw the lure back on here. Okay, and then we should be pretty good on everything else. Let's see, um, bottle the clean water. We should still have, so basically for water, you almost need three stacks. You need an empty stack, a clean stack, and a cooking stack, maybe. <laughs> oh, I forgot I could even do that. So now we have, let's see, we have a dirty stack in here. So let's go and throw that in there. Make another membrane. And then we're gonna make our radar and then uh we're gonna see where that takes us so what we've got going on now is we're still looking for hello i'll take you and then let's see uh where was it location radar displays location and navigation points that sounds exciting so now we're gonna have like pings we're gonna have destinations that's super cool all right so our location radar uh oh holy moly we have things like kind of ways away okay all right so we've got things um what do we need for building like if i wanted to build rooms synthetics and metals I'm trying to see how much how much stuff i need here because like this this cockpit in the center area is fine i kind of want to widen it out though like i, I want to have like i think three rooms across so i'd like to add like one two three four five six seven i'd like to add seven more rooms i think seven more rooms will give us a lot of room to make sure that we have like everything we need and then obviously we're gonna need catwalks around it so like if okay so seven more rooms um oh oh that's a lot I can only make what three because of metal right now and then oh there's also the ladder room yeah so definitely that'd be enough and then we'd also need metal floors and then doors and then we also probably need walls uh railings would be nice so like we need a whole bunch of stuff here you know what let's go ahead i want one there i want one there and i want one there okay now can i go ahead oh we have enough for another one i can't put one there uh, can we put some floors in here, maybe? One, two, not enough resources. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and gather resources. We're going to make this airship happen, like, right now. All right, look at that. Walls are look. I mean, we got, we got some rooms in here. So, I need to have... I need to move this engine towards the back. So, I think we're going to use a door right there. And then, uh, from there, what I need to do is I actually need to do catwalks. Catwalks are actually fairly cheap. Cannot place inside. I don't want to place inside. I want to place on the outside. Ooh, there we go. These are kind of finicky to place down, aren't they? Not to mention it makes the floor underneath of me disappear and it's kind of terrifying. There we go. Weight limit reached? Oh no! Oh shoot, I didn't realize <laughs> I didn't realize there was a weight limit. Um, how does that oh, how does that work? Can we can we upgrade our weight limit? Oh no. Um Okay, if there's a weight limit, we're gonna have to seriously reconsider this because, uh, uh, well, oh, you know what? Does it have to do with, maybe it has to do with the amount of those that I have. Ship load is 500 out of 500. Okay. We need to kind of make our way towards something here. 208. Let's go ahead. You know what? Let's head, let's head, let's turn around. If we're gonna head in a direction, let's head in a direction where there's multiple things, maybe. All right, let's see if this is gonna. Wow, that's a long. Oh, I must be hitting something here. That is a long ways over there. Holy moly. We're definitely, we're definitely gonna be hopping and skipping from uh, place to place on the way here. Yeah, I think if we're gonna hit a weight limit of 500, I feel like we're gonna need to, we're gonna need to do something here. We're gonna need to see if I can put more, um, more fans on, if that'll give us more weight, or if I need to, uh, maybe, maybe not. Maybe the, 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 the airship part at the, the top, the blimp, <laughs> maybe that's maxed out. Oh, ship was damaged. Floating debris is a threat when flying at low altitude is the third. The severity of the damage depends on the speed. Okay, we need, oh, reach the exclamation point on the marker. All right, well, we're gonna go ahead and land here. 
And then let's see which way is all this stuff coming from. Maybe so we'll be fine if we just land right here. All right, we gotta see. I gotta see if I can repair something. I don't even know if I have the ability to repair or not. Okay, so it says shipload. Hold on. So if I get another basic turbine here, electric elements. What the heck? Can I craft electric elements? Oh, you know what? I need to go ahead and sleep too. Darn it. Okay, let's see if we can do. Can we craft electric elements? Motherboard, helium, fuel. Oh, electric elements right there. Oh, I needed one. Oh, what if I deconstruct this? Remove. Did I get my... Oh, I got my electric elements back. Okay, hold on. So let's get our electric element research because we need that in order to, to make more. So we'll get that and then the repair tape. I didn't even know that one. I didn't even know that's what that was for. Okay, so let's see here. Um, So we can make uh, out of synthetics and copper. Okay, good. In order for me to go ahead and make another wind turbine deal, we're going to need a few of those. We're gonna see if I can craft, if I craft another one of these, I'm gonna see if my weight increases. Oh my God, I just realized I'm making like five at a time. Okay, <laughs> I made a lot of just elements right there. <laughs> ah, darn it. I thought I was making one at a time, I was making five. Oh, I need to pay attention when it says that. Okay, so if I throw another basic turbine on here, will that give us more lift? I don't know. All right, so let's set this out here somewhere. Not enough, oh, I can't even place it because I don't have enough lift. Okay, so hold on. If I want to, so if I want to place this, oh, this is going to be interesting. Um, let's remove that and remove that. And then if I do uh, this guy, maximum flight altitude increase, but our, li okay, so our limit as far as the load goes has not been increased. Okay, so we're going to have to, um, unfortunately, we're going to have to make our ship a little bit smaller than what I wanted to. So I'm going to go ahead and move some of these things. Wait a second. It says use the airship builder to expand the balloon. There must be an upgrade. There must be an upgrade that I haven't gotten yet to expand the balloon. Okay. So uh, it's probably at the explanation point. So what are we going to do? Basically, this is the room that I have right now. So yeah, I just increased. I basically brought it up by one. Put up this area up here. Um, I'm gonna bring those back. I'm gonna put the back door in here. I think we'll be good. I don't know for sure actually, because now I think about it, how much? What is the what is the weight of? So that's a 15. That's 15 by itself. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna have to mess with this in a minute. I'm waiting for the storm to pass because I can't get any more metals until it passes. Okay, so I've got this door here. We got our turbine here. We got our our um our engine here. I can go ahead and close that door and then yes those are all nicely stacked back there what's my weight overall right now so 500 to 500 <laughs> darn it i was hoping to get more stuff in here um well darn you know what <sighs> well i guess that i guess that's all i can do right now i was hoping to get um possibly another uh another water refining thing over here and yeah i was hoping to get some more storage crates and stuff but i guess we're gonna have to figure that out so Let's go ahead. Let's get our food and water back uh, situation back under control. So that's good. And then did we grab this guy yet? Okay, let's go ahead and eat our boiled moth. Absolutely delicious. We're going to go in here. We're going to grab this. And then we're going to go to an exclamation point and see if we can increase the size of our balloon here because we need a bigger ship. Oh, metal wall. Ooh, we got a metal wall now, which is going to just add weight to our ship that we don't really have anyways. <laughs> So it is what it is, but okay. So that all looks good. Uh, let's see. We have a ladder going up top. We'll run up top. See if there's anything up here though. I don't think there is. No, we also, we have the ability to make a hand extractor so we can actually extract this stuff by hand. That might actually be something worth doing. Then we don't have to worry about moving our ship constantly into view. Okay. So let's see here. If we go and look at this guy, was there a, yeah, an extractor. Oh, an energy crystal and plastic scrap. Um, oh, we probably should go and research. We probably should research everything we can. Okay, so that looks good. Uh, let's see. What do we need for fuel? Synthetics. All right, I'm going to go and grab some more synthetics. We got to make a bunch of fuel because we got a long ways to go. Okay, what else can we research here? Transformer. Do we have a transformer? Uh, we can make one. Let's go ahead and get, or we can go ahead and research it. Let's get that going. Another thing of fuel, more synthetic fuel. I like this door back here because then we can just open the door. We can access the engine. This is fantastic. We can throw that in there. We can go ahead and shut the door. Maybe. I don't want to move this stuff around. All right, let's throw the research station like right here. And let's throw the bed, maybe like right here on this side. 
Kind of get him out of the way, you know? Oh, I like that so much better. Oh, I just wish... See, I think even if I craft, like, if even if I can't craft, like, anything, because I need, um, like, a store... See, that has weight. This has weight. Everything has weight to it. And <laughs> I maxed it out. <laughs> I have successfully maxed it out. Okay, let's do it. Let's go to an exclamation point here. We're at 1.79 away. And then we could actually go ahead... We could lock speed here. Well, what's the wind pushing? Is the wind pushing against us? The wind is pushing against us. All right, speed is locked and we can just basically continue going. And while we're going, let's go ahead and harvest some things. Now, actually, it might be worth stopping over here at these wind turbines because they have copper. Copper's really handy. I mean, we're actually not that far. 1.4, we're at, we're, we've gotten like half of a kilometer so far. <laughs> I wonder if we can get our, um, oh, we can't get the extract because we don't have an energy crystal yet. Oh yeah, but see like, look at this guy. This guy's got, uh, this guy's got copper just sticking out of it everywhere. You know what? Actually, we're going to go ahead and we're going to grab some of this right now. I want to put the, um, I want to put, I want to end up putting that thing right on the nose of this. So it'll be a little bit easier to, uh, to aim <laughs> or to get to where I need to be. Perfect. Got some copper, got some glass from here. Wow. I can get the copper all the way from the, the other side. Holy moly. We might as well stop and grab helium and stuff too while we're here. See if we can find anything good in here. Ooh, old food ration. That's actually really handy. because <laughs> I need some food right now. Uh, I was about to have to go farm it, but you know what? We'll see, eat that. Mm, delicious. Absolutely. Del oh, more GPUs, baby. We can sell these on the market. Uh-huh. Data card. What do we got? What do we got? Short railing. Okay. You know, I got to say, this game is absolutely fantastic. I'm having so much fun with this right now. This is very, like, this is giving me the Subnautica vibes that I haven't had in, you know, quite some time. Like, the original Subnautica vibes. You know, like, you go around... You find stuff, you collect stuff. It's just like, it just, it feels really good. You really don't know what's going on. It's a strange world. It's something different. I just, I'm really enjoying this. Um, okay. I think we got everything for the most part. We're going to go ahead and research the uh, rainwater collector too. Because then when it rains, we could get some free water. That would be really nice. And if we had a few of those up, we might not actually have or have to use the, uh, the membrane dealy anymore. Advanced insect lure. Oh, very nice. Um, we don't have energy crystal yet. Circuit board. Oh, let's go ahead and research that just because we already have that. Battery level's looking good. All right, we're moving on. Oh, hold on. There's a question mark on the map. We've got to see what the, what is the question mark. Okay, so I see the, I see this tower right in front of us. Looks like this one's a question mark for some reason though. Oh, <gasps> what is that? There's like squigglies. Like those look like plants. Oh. Those look like, like, like plants or something like giant trees or something. Oh, what is that? There's also, there's a question mark over here though. Why is there a question mark over here? There's multiple question marks. Oh, this one's like on like a, a surface of like a plant. Like we're going to be landing like on a plant itself instead of the, uh, instead of the tower. Oh, what is this stuff? Okay. There's definitely a question mark down here. We got to go check this out. This is like getting low. Like this is like as low as we could probably should go. What is going on here? Hold on, let's try to... Low altitude, overgrown tower. Detecting new objects requiring scanning. Let's see what we got here. We are like, we're like really dangerously low. What is this? Some kind of vines? Thick creepers? Oh, tool required knife. A climber with a very thick, tough stem has grown. Blocking the passage, source of valuable material. Oh, and there's like, there's plants in there. Oh, we don't have a knife though. Yeah, we don't have any way to get in there. What's that? Bruise flower, fragile decorative plant. This species was thought to be extinct. Can I have you? No. Huh. Darn, I wanted you. So we would need a knife in order to get in here. And then there's like, there's plants in there. I wonder if we can have like gardens and stuff eventually. And we can grow like our own food on our ship. Oh, that'd be super cool. I bet you we can. I bet we can at some point. This is, this is neat. This is so cool. I honestly, I'm, this, I'm at the point where I have no idea what to expect with this game. And I love it. Um, our inventory is full. Okay. Do we drop anything? Oh, do we drop anything? What is this? Helium fuel? Absolutely not. Not helium fuel. No, we don't drop anything. Okay. What is this? Wrecked tool charger. Okay. Hold on. We've got a, oh, data car repair. Tank. You know, what? I'm going to grab what I can because I, it'll just stack and then I'll come back for everything. I can't grab, which actually looks like it might just be the membrane. Wrecked tool charger effectively charges the energy of less demanding tools uses solid state batteries interesting okay does it hurt me if i just go right here no okay cool we can fall a little bit okay so i need this battery inventory was full so i can take the battery and then let's go ahead i'm going to take the uh electric elements the i'm not worried about the that thing it's not gonna yeah, it's not worth it you know 
it's too cheap to make okay everything is looking fantastic um i'm trying to figure out what we should do here as far as i need more storage <laughs> i really really need more storage so i'm thinking we might need to take out some rooms i could take out this room and this room right here and then that would give us like a ton more or actually if i just got rid of one of these rooms that would give us a ton more um because i think one room weighs like 30 and i need to be able to build i need another storage box which is five so i mean i could take out one i could i could take out two i could take out this one and that one and then we'd have like a weird looking cross ship thing here but uh it would work temporarily <laughs> but i just i need storage so bad so let's see what else oh we have a knife oh polymer mm, that's something new and then there's a tool charger which we can actually make that oh <gasps> i'm a dummy expand balloon each expansion of the balloon increases lifting capacity balloon core uh the base for the balloon each airship has at least one but it is possible to add more parallel balloons to increase balloon lift capacity so i can expand the balloon for one helium and four copper or are you kidding hold on a second i can add another balloon balloon core oh wait hold on a second though will that i'm gonna research it and see what happens we're gonna have to build it i already know we're gonna have to build it um I'm gonna grab some of this coffee real quick and then we're gonna research the next one too. We're gonna research the expansion. Uh, requires airship builder. Okay, and then uh, expand balloon. So we've got this build balloon, balloon core. So I need, actually that's not, that's not bad. I only need two more helium. Expand balloon requires airship builder. Okay, so now if I go in, so if I go into here, expand wait why wouldn't i go with this though because that's gonna give us an additional 500. the base for the balloon each airship has at least one but it is possible to add more parallel balloons to increase lift capacity that would give us another 500 wouldn't it versus this just giving us i'm actually really curious to see if we can add a whole nother balloon like can we just have like a double wide balloon and then be like connected oh that'd be super cool wouldn't it or maybe we should just increase the one we already have i don't know how much it's gonna increase oh it increases by 400. i would say that that's worth it let's do it oh did it just add another one i think it did i can't expand anymore okay so now oh now we're good oh my gosh i thought we had to go to like the new area to get the balloon expansion <laughs> but we're good look at that we have so much more room to build things oh okay so you know what i'm actually gonna do is i'm not gonna expand uh, i'm gonna go ahead and build storage things like that get the other stuff inside built because those things do add up i also want to put some railings along the outside like i said i want to put some railings along the outside here around the front i want to put this in the front so we can harvest things in the front. I want to have, um, I actually want to increase this area, have more things out here. We need uh, some like dirty water collectors. Cause like we got this new um, rainwater collector deal, which I really want to get going. So, oh my gosh, all kinds of wonderful things, but that's going to end it. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did like subscribe, all the fun things, this is forever skies. And you can bet we will be back playing some more. So make sure you leave a like on the video, subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you in the next one. Bye everybody.